Hey, hey, it's your girl Chrissy Monet, and I am back with another video. So today's video is finally my furnished apartment tour, you guys. I'm so excited to do this video for you guys today as it has been well overdue. Let's just say that, okay? <laughs> um, yes, but I've been in my apartment now for like eight months. Wow, it has really been almost eight months since I've been in my apartment. Can y'all believe that? Can y'all believe that it's been eight months since y'all just seen that empty apartment tour? Well, hmm, if you haven't seen that video, <laughs> then go check that one out um, because I do have an empty apartment tour showing you guys what this apartment looks like before all of the furniture was in it. But now I have fully furnished, well, pretty much I would say it's like pretty much like 96 98 percent done um and I am in love with it so anyways I hope you guys love it also you guys I put a lot of effort and time into these videos and I love it this is my passion so please guys please subscribe to my channel if you're watching this video then please 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 you should subscribe okay it's the click of a button so go ahead and click that button and subscribe to your girl's channel and we're just gonna get right into this tour Hey you guys, so just like in the empty apartment tour, we are gonna start at the front door. So this is my front door, and then next to it is my electrical closet right here. And I decided to put a doormat right here in front of the door. Um, I have one outside of the door as well, but I thought that it would be really cute and functional to put one inside as well so that when people come in, they can take their shoes off without getting so much dirt on the floor and then put their shoes right here. Yay! <laughs> I'm, no, I'm really pumped about this. I got this little shoe rack right here. Um, it's a little cute little miniature white shoe rack for people to put their shoes. Um, you can put your shoes under it or also on top of it. So I love that it just gives you a lot of space there to be able to put quite a few shoes. So um, yeah, I got this doormat y'all. <laughs> from Amazon and it just says welcome. I know you can't tell it's upside down, but that's so that when you're opening the door coming in, you can read it and it says welcome. And then this white shoe rack is also from Amazon. So a lot of the items that I have in my apartment are from Amazon, you guys. And I will have as many things as I can think of linked or as I can find linked down below for y'all in the description box. But anyways, that's just the alarm system once again. And then moving on to the kitchen. So here's my refrigerator right next to the front door. And then when you come over here, um, I just have this knife set sitting here in the little corner in this cute little nook. Um, and I got that knife set from Amazon as well. It came with a knife sharpener as well as a pair of um, like meat scissors or kitchen scissors as you will. Um, and then I got this little like spoon holder for when you're cooking and stuff and you need to rest your spoons and things like that on it. I got this from, 
my mom got this for me yeah my mom got that for me i will ask her where she got it from and then i will try to find it and link it down below for y'all so moving on over here on the left side of the stove i just have these um coasters i have these little coasters right here i think they're so pretty they're marble and those are from amazon of course and then right here going on in this little corner i have like my coffee station so i thought that was really cute to set up a little coffee station over here as i do have a lot of countertop space so right here i have my sugar jar and i got this sugar jar from target so as y'all can see it just it's white and black so it goes with my whole aesthetic which is white black gray and pink um and then i got this little k-cup holder and it actually spins y'all it's so cute look at that it spins But um, I got that from Amazon, and then I have a Keurig right here, and it's pink. I opted for the pink and gray one, obviously, and it's from Target. And then moving on, kind of right next to the Keurig is, I got this little pink flower vase. It was a clear flower vase, but, I, but it has pink flowers in it with green petals and I got that from Amazon like it came together so you don't need to buy the flowers in the pot or the vase separate so super cute I just wanted to add a little bit more pink into the kitchen and then moving on right here um, on the left side of my sink I have this little tray and it is white and gray marble I don't know if you guys can tell that it is marble but yeah I got that from Amazon and then I just have my sponge from Target on top of there as well as these two little um, soap dispensers so I don't think I'm gonna keep these particular ones but I got one for my dish detergent and one for hand soap but I don't think I'm gonna keep these two because I think I can find some prettier I'm not completely in love with these so yeah and then next to that is my paper towel holder which was gifted to me as a housewarming gift from my sister so thank you bunny um and yeah it's just simple simple but chic and cute and it goes with my aesthetic and I just have some paper towels on there <laughs> um and on the floor real quick in front of the sink and in front of the stove as well i have some floor mats um and these came together as a set and they are both from amazon once again um and they're just gray and they have this really beautiful pattern on them that I think just looks so pretty with like my kitchen backsplash. So I really, really, really love these mats. I was so happy when I found these. Um, I originally had like some white furry ones in here, which were cute, but they were a little small and they just weren't giving the vibes. Um, and they just felt more like cheap. Um, so I wanted something a little more luxury and like classy and I love these. And I just wanted to also bring a little bit more gray into the kitchen. Oh, and then I have some little dish towels right here hanging on my stove. And I got those from Target. And if you look up close, oops, if you look up close, they are white, but they also have kind of that same pattern that's on the mats and in gray and I think they just look so good in the kitchen nice fresh white and then moving on oh 
let me not forget to show y'all my little trash can area so right on the side of my island i have my trash can and um originally as you guys saw in the tour a black trash can did come with my apartment but it just wasn't like flowing and blending and looking right with everything else so i got this one and it's just like a silver one it's so shiny isn't it y'all i love this trash can and um it's the perfect size i got it from amazon as well and i got me a wallflower right there <laughs> so it's smelling good in here yes and then I then have my little island setup going on. It's not much. Um, I decided to just keep it very simple with the island, but I still think that this, what I have going on is really pretty. So this tray right here is going with the same, you know, white and gray marble, like everything else that I just showed you guys. And I got this from Amazon. And then I have these three beautiful, can y'all see that? Oh, the camera is not even doing them justice, you guys. These are stunning. These are candle holders. Um, I did put some little, short little white candles inside. So cute. Um, yeah, and they're like broken glass and they have like the acrylic bases and they're tiered. And then I have a candle in front. It's my champagne toast. That's an oldie but a goodie. Um, that's all the girls' faves, okay? So if you don't know about it, get into it. And then I have this really cute love sign in the back of the candle holders, which just kind of adds a little something extra to kind of fill up that space inside of the tray. And that is from Amazon. The candle holders are from Amazon and of course the candle is White Barn. And then look at my bar stools you guys. These are my bar stools. Yep, so I put two bar stools here and they fit perfectly. And let me just pull them out so you guys can kind of see what they are looking like. So yeah, it's just these little bar stools right here. Um, and I like how they have the armrests, even though they sit pretty low. Oops, the armrests sit pretty low. Um, and I did, I got these from a place called One Stop Bedrooms. Um, but they have these bar stools like everywhere. Like, girl, you can get these off of Wayfair. Um, y'all know these places pretty much sell the same things, just putting different prices on them. But yeah, girl, so these gorgeous velvet gray bar stools are from one stop bedrooms because they were a little bit cheaper on that website so girl save you some coins where you can save you some coins okay and they have these really cute mirrored silver bases and that is the kitchen now moving on to this little part i forgot to show y'all <laughs> it's like the little shelving area on the island and this is what i got going on with it so this beautiful like crystal stone um and it's pink so cute i got that from mm, tj maxx i want to say yeah i got that from tj maxx um, and then this little, this is actually like a pretty little candle holder. And then these actually came together. And this is like a little tall candle. Um, it's like the fake kind. And that is from Hobby Lobby. And then on the second shelf, these beautiful bookends right here. Um, they're so pretty, you guys. I absolutely am obsessed with these. And I got these from Amazon. 
the books in between them it says paris new york london i got those from amazon as well so yes i love this little area right here so now we're moving on into the living room In this corner right here, I have this beautiful, beautiful curved lamp. And I got this from Wayfair. I love it, y'all. And it's still, it's going with that same white and gray marble in the base. And then, you know, it just has this like chandelier look, which is so pretty to me. And then, let's get into the couch. So this stunning gray velvet sofa, you guys, is from a place called Chic Home. And I absolutely love it. It's small, but it's so beautiful. I could not help myself. And it is so perfect in this space, y'all. Look at that. Look at that. The throw is from Amazon, I wanna say. Yep, the throw is from Amazon. And then I just paired it with some pillows right here. This is kind of my pillow arrangement that I have going on. So the silver pillows in the back, those are from Hobby Lobby. And then these two gray ones that I have, they came with the couch. And then these pretty accent pillows to kind of add a pop to it all. These are from Amazon. And then I have this plant over here in the corner that I paired with this mirror. So the story about this mirror, you guys, I actually bought this mirror from Wayfair and it was supposed to go in my bedroom. Um, but when they brought it in and they put it in my bedroom, I realized that it is tiny. <laughs> It's tiny, you guys, and I was not expecting that. So I decided that why not try it in here and put it in the corner and put a nice plant next to it and just give it like a, I don't know, it just gives it like a Miami-like, just chic, adds a little modern, adds a little greenery, you know, very pretty. The plant, you guys, is from Ikea. And I think it's cute with the black base. Just adds a little bit of black in here. And then like I said, the mirror is from Wayfair. And then before we pan on over to this area, let's talk about these paintings. So these paintings right here, um, I actually kind of like framed them myself. Um, so the actual like canvases, the artwork, is from Amazon and then the frames are from Amazon as well but they came separately you guys so I picked out these and I really loved it they're gray and pink and white and they are like marble if you guys can tell and they kind of have a little bit of sparkliness going on at the top just stunning um so yeah and but they came unframed so i had to frame them and like i said both came from amazon and like i said i will link everything down below but yeah it was really kind of you know this was a challenge to kind of like size everything out because once again it is such a huge wall look at this look how tall that wall is you guys so having to kind of fill up that space was a bit tricky but we figured it out and I'm not mad at it. I think it looks pretty. So let me know what you guys think down below. And moving on right in front of the window. Ooh, there's me. <laughs> right in front of the window, I decided to put this chair, which also, as you guys can see, it matches the couch perfectly. Yep, it also came from Chic Home. And it has the tufts 
the tough thing going on as well inside and outside like on the outsides but it does not have the diamonds inside of the tufts like the couch which is completely fine you guys it does not have to have that um and it's still really pretty and it still matches perfectly and these are what the legs look like it has silver leg and it has the rhinestones going around the arms just like the couch so yeah really really pretty and then this pillow that i got to go inside of the chair i thought a round pillow would look good in there i got that from zazzle And then next to my couch, I had this extra end table because they sent me one that was damaged that is still in my bedroom. So they sent me a new one and I didn't have anything to do with it. So <laughs> I just decided to put it in here to kind of just fill the room up and make it look even more homey. Um, and I think because it's mirrored, I think it's doing just good. It's not making it look too crowded in here. And then this lamp right here that I decided to place on top of the end table, which is so beautiful, you guys. Look at that. Look at the intricate detailing. I got that from Amazon. And then over here on this wall across from the couch is my TV and my TV stand. So I have this big, um, I think it's a 65 inch TV. Um, the cord cover that I decided to use to cover my cords with, they are from Amazon. And then this TV stand is Ikea and I love it. It has the glass doors right here that you just then push to open and push to close. And it has a drawer at the bottom in the middle. And then you guys, I still need to get a shelf to go here. Um, it didn't like come with the whole setup, but they did that so you can have the option to put either a white shelf there or a glass one, which I think I'm gonna do glass. But yep, and then on top, I got these stunning, beautiful, rhinestone candle holders and they're also tiered and I believe it was a set of only two and I think I bought two sets um, these they're from Amazon of course and the little pink candles inside are from Amazon they're completely separate um, they actually go with some other candles that I bought for my bedroom but I thought they looked pretty in here and there was only two so I put some white ones in here I'll probably change those out eventually but for now you know it looks fine so pretty and then in the middle I have these three books stacked on top of each other and it's Christian Dior, Christian Dior and Coco Chanel and um yeah they're just some faux books you guys they're not real they're just for decor and I got those from those ones right there are from Walmart Walmart's website and then this beautiful little tray with the like um, broken glass balls on it and stuff that is from Amazon and it came together as a set so it will be linked down below and last but not least in my living room well let's talk about this rug you guys I got this beautiful white and gray fluffy furry rug from Amazon and it is so soft and so comfy and then this is my coffee table this is what I decided to do with my coffee table so first and foremost, this beautiful glass coffee table with like the acrylic legs is from Wayfair. And then I decided to put this mirrored tray with the silver border, which is just so beautiful. I got it from Amazon and I decided to put some magazines right here on top and then um 
and those magazines I just got them like from they for some reason they mailed me so many of these you guys and um, I just kept them and they ended up coming in handy so yeah and then this little like orb right here is also from Amazon and then this beautiful pink marble candle is actually from Ross you guys so don't sleep on them they be having some good stuff okay and I put it in this candle holder it's actually separate oh it's stuck together but it's separate this candle holder is from Bath and Body Works and then this little plant in the back is from Hobby Lobby so that is the little tray, the centerpiece. And then on both sides, I have the clear crystal tea light candle holders and they're tiered as well. And so I have three on this side and three on this side. So yeah, I'll link those down below. And then I just put some little um, coasters there <laughs> to kind of add to the look of everything. And that is my living room. Now moving into the bedroom, guys. Yeah. So in this area, remember I was telling you guys in the beginning, that I am like 98% done with my apartment um, decorating and everything. So this is not gonna stay here. This is actually my hamper, <laughs> my clean clothes hamper. Um, but isn't it cute? It matches like my kitchen rugs. Um, but yeah, it's gray and white and it has the same pattern on it. And it's just, yeah, that's my hamper. I have another one in my closet for my dirty clothes. But I just kind of set that there for now because it's still cute. But I do intend on getting a nice, tall, green plant to go there to add some greenery back here as well. Um, but I have been having a hard time finding one. So for now, that's there. And then over here in the middle of this wall, we have my TV. I think back here I have a 55 inch and then this is my beautiful gorgeous glass mirrored tv stand or not tv stand dresser i will link that down below and then on top of there i have these two candle holders two on each side like i said they came as a set that's actually where those pink little small candles in the living room came from um, and those are from Amazon and once again they have that same pattern and then I have this beautiful like arched candle holder centerpiece thing <laughs> and it's from Amazon it is stunning isn't it and I put some white candles inside and I also have my cords covered. And I also have LED lights to you guys around my TVs. Just to point that out. And then over here in the corner on the left side of my TV stand or my dresser is this stunning mirror, you guys. But isn't it gorgeous? Isn't it stunning? Yes. Anyway, and then across from that wall is of course the main attraction. It's my bed. So this bed is from a place called Right At Home. And um, I will link it down below. It's here in Atlanta. Um, so they actually have a local um, store where you can go in and shop and but this bed in particular was only online but yeah it's gray and it's velvet and it's tufted as well like my sofa it looks a lot like my sofa and it has the rhinestones in the tufts as well and then this white floor rug that i have 
on my floor. It's an area rug. I got it from Amazon. It's just this white fluffy rug. I thought it kind of paired well. Guys, never mind the way I have my, my bed made. I am still working on that, okay? So don't judge me. But yeah, and then this is my bed, how I have it kind of made. So I have white sheets underneath here. And then this beautiful soft velvet uh, duvet is from Kohl's. And then this throw right here, I decided to get this knitted throw to add some texture back here. And it has tassels on it, which I think are so cute. And I got that from Amazon. And then the pillow situation, let's talk about that. So these pillowcases came with the duvet, of course. So I have two back here, and then I have two just plain white pillows. Those are the ones I sleep on. And then I have four pillows going across, and they're, they were like a set. So this one says my style with a lady with a dress and this one has a bag with flowers and like the other one is a perfume bottle um, with flowers in it. Those are from Amazon. It was a set of four. And then these two pink ones are from Hobby Lobby, I think. And then this sparkly one in the middle is Amazon. And then this little one right here actually came in a... Um, comforter set that I originally bought to go in here that I ended up not liking I just kept the pillow from it and I actually still have it in my closet but um, I kept the pillow and I thought it looked really pretty on my bed and then this little tray gray tray is from Amazon I eat on this tray and everything so it's very functional and then I decided to put a magazine on it and it's like black and white to add some black back here and then I put my remote and my LED light remote on there. And then this picture that I have, this painting above my bed, this is from Amazon. And I thought it was so pretty and it just matches my pillows and it matches the bed perfectly. And then I have I was telling y'all about these end tables. These are actually end tables, not nightstands. Yeah, so I have one on each side of my bed. And then these flowers are the same ones I have like in my kitchen. But I got the cream colored ones to go back here on my nightstand. And then these little pretty um, broken glass like candle holders. I got these from Hobby Lobby. And then I put some of these little pink um, candles inside. And then my lamp right there is from Amazon. And I love these because they're taller than some of the other ones I was seeing. And so they look good with my tall headboard. And yes, you guys, that is my room. closet you guys I'm just gonna briefly show y'all my closet because it is nowhere near done um and yeah it's nowhere near done for one and then two look at this <laughs> I have all of my Christmas stuff in here that I still need to put out and things I was waiting until after I filmed this but just to kind of give you guys a gist of what my closet is looking like thus far um, I put this cute little round gray and white circular rug in here and I think it's so cute and I have my little pink ottoman on top of it so this round rug right here is from Amazon of course and then this pink ottoman is from Wayfair and then I have some shoe racks going across the wall down here on the floor and yeah I just kind of organized them a little bit um but it's a work in progress and got some little boots that wouldn't fit on there that I just sat there and then my clothes 
are all here these are my fall clothes and then i just have my makeup organized in these beautiful i love these um little organizers that i got from ross so once again don't sleep on ross these are gorgeous and they're mirrored and everything i mean not mirrored they're um well yeah they're clear see-through um but i was saying they're marble on the sides and yeah and then i have this little um eyeshadow palette organizer that i got from amazon and this lazy susan right here that i decided to put my makeup brushes in as well as like hair ties and bobby pins and things is from ross and then my clothes are kind of covering this which i have to figure that sit yo out <laughs> but yeah this is from amazon and then I just have a few little perfumes back there and then another one on this side. So I kind of have like my silver and gold jewelry kind of like separated. Girl, we got to get this closet together, okay? But at the top, there was that comforter I was telling y'all about that I didn't like. So if you want it, let me know. I can sell it to you. And yeah, it's got some fun. Um, oh, I'm about to fall some organizing um bins right there that i got from amazon um they're so cute aren't they they're pink and like have roses on them but yeah and that's just to store some things in my youtube stuff equipment up there and then on this side look y'all i love these these are we'll have some more and i gotta get all this stuff taken care of but for now this is kind of like the idea of it have my purses and bags and things going across with like this cute mannequin head in the middle and just adds a girly touch and then and i'm thinking about even like making her face like putting her on some makeup and lipstick and stuff that would be cute and then um these paintings right here these three little pieces of artwork i got from amazon i think they are so pretty and girly so yeah and then yeah, I have all my longer stuff hung on this side. My dirty clothes hamper is back here behind the door. And I have a little step stool that has really come in clutch since I've been living here. And then it's another shoe rack back there that y'all can't see because of all this Christmas stuff that we have got to get out. So that is the closet, you guys. Nothing even to show. And then moving on to the bathroom this is my bathroom you guys so i got these floor mats right here um and they're pink and like so pretty these are from amazon so i have a longer one in front of the shower and then the shorter one in front of the sink and then on top of my gorgeous marbled sink, I have just a tissue box sitting here just for functionality purposes and a wallflower, of course. But yeah, just in case people need tissue, they can grab it or whatever. Um, and then this beautiful tray next to it. I absolutely love it. It looks like, like rain or something like water. And then it has the little handles that look like um, branches. So it just adds to the like serene, peaceful, like outdoor spa vibes. That was the vibe I was going for in here. Um, but yeah, so this tray is from Amazon. And then these three little apothecary jars. I got these from Amazon. I didn't know they were this tiny, but I, so that's why I ended up just kind of figuring they would look cute sitting out here on my counter i still don't know if i'm gonna leave that like that um let me know what you guys think down below if i should leave that there or if i should put something else on this tray um it is a perfume tray but yeah and so i just have i need to <laughs> refill these by the way but i have some q-tips some little cotton pads that i use for my face and then some cotton balls so guests can use these things as well and then moving over here to the left side of the sink, I have another one of these little um, tea light candle holders. I had an extra one, so I decided to put it back here um, in my bathroom. I think it kind of looks pretty there. 
and then I have this stunning, oh, so beautiful, this broken glass clump, <laughs> a little round um, soap dispenser. I found this in Walmart, you guys. Like, I literally stumbled across it and I swooped it up so quick. I was like, come here. <laughs> so beautiful. And um, yeah, that's from Walmart and it matches my trash can, y'all. Like, look at this, look at this. Well, we jump in the gun, but I just had to show y'all that. It looked like it's a set, don't it? Doesn't it? But it's not. <laughs> um, and then this cute little um, plant right here, you guys, is from, I think it's from Hobby Lobby. I'll let y'all know. And then, look how I did my tissue. <laughs> That's how like the cleaners do it. And then next to my toilet, which I'm sure y'all don't really wanna see too much of, but next to it is my beautiful trash can that we were just talking about. On top of my toilet right here, I have this beautiful, little clear acrylic napkin holder and that's from Amazon and I have some napkins inside so people can dry their hands if they don't want to use the towel I know how some people can be about things like that and then I have a hand towel right here hanging on my hand towel rack and the hand towel is from Amazon and then I have this beautiful holder you guys this is actually a curtain holder <laughs> So like if you have curtains hanging on your windows, this is to kind of pull them to the side like that. So you can see out your window. But I got one for my hand towel. Yep, I sure did. <laughs> and I think it's stunning. Is that not so cute? I don't know, I love it. I think it just kind of brings it together, gives the towel some shape and makes it look prettier instead of just hanging like square. And then I have this painting right here above the toilet that I absolutely love. It's very serene and peaceful and spa-like. And I got that from Amazon and it's so pretty with the stones. So y'all see I'm going for that stone vibe because look at my shower liner, you guys. So I was never able to find a long enough shower curtain for my bathroom because it's just so tall. They don't really sell that length anywhere except Amazon. And on Amazon, they only had like really plain ones or like ugly ones. <laughs> so I was able to find though this beautiful shower liner that kind of goes for, you know, a curtain vibe. And it has like stones all over it. It's just really giving that spa vibe. And then I have these two shower caddies that I got from Amazon. So yep. And then to sit my soap on, my bar soap, I have this white and gray marble little tray. And I got this from Amazon. Isn't that so cute? And it just matches everything perfectly. And then here's my bathtub caddy that I use when I take baths. You can sit your phone on it. You can sit a drink on it while you're in the tub. And that is from Amazon. It's white and clear. And then I just put two little candles on there because I didn't know what else to put on there, y'all. But I think that looks cute. When you exit the bathroom, right here on this big wall that used to be blank, <laughs> I decided to put this beautiful round mirror that actually looks a lot like the mirror that's in my room. Yep, so I got one to go here and they're from two different places once again. Um, I don't remember where the one in my room is from but I'll link it down below. And this one is from Amazon. So, <laughs> yes. And that is everything. So, yes, you guys. That is my stunning, stunning, stunning apartment 
tour you guys i hope that you guys love everything as much as i do i love being in here every time i walk in i'm just like oh my gosh is this really my place <laughs> did i really decorate all this did i do that y'all let me know in the comments below and also let me know by giving this video a thumbs up if you really enjoyed it and um, let me know what was some of you guys' favorite pieces, what's your favorite room in my apartment. And also, like I said, you guys, please, 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 please don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you would like to see more videos like this. And it will also send you notifications every time I upload. So you guys do not miss a post because wink wink we got a lot of good stuff coming okay and i will be doing a little segment for christmas you'll see stay tuned bye